What is going on you guys? It's your girl Diana, back at you with another YouTube video. Recently Niantic dropped all of the information for the dazzling dream event in Pokemon Go, so today I'll be going over all of the details, you know exactly what to expect. So let's go ahead and hop into it. Bye. Bye. You already know that it's gonna be a big event when we're in this setup. So the Dazzling Dream event is set to run from Saturday, January 13th at 10 a.m. local time to Tuesday, January 16th at 8 p.m. local time. So it's a three day event. And during this event, we will be getting a couple event bonuses, including two times the Stardust for catching Pokemon and two times the Stardust for hatching Pokemon. And here's where things start to get a little buck wild because we have a ton of wild encounters that we can expect during this event. For starters, Flabby Bee with different color flowers will be appearing in the wild depending on where you are in the world. So Red Flabby Bee will be appearing in Europe, the Middle East, and Africa. Blue Flabby Bee will be appearing in the Asia Pacific region, and Yellow Flabby Bee will be appearing in the Americas. And if you're lucky, you might encounter White Flower Flabby Bee and Orange Flower Flabby Bee no matter where you are. And in addition to the Flabby Bees, you'll also be able to encounter Clefairy, Jigglypuff, Meryl, Snubble, Cottony, my love, I love Cottony so much, and Whimsicott, it's literally on my Portland team. Of course, the Flabby Bee, so the red, the blue, and the yellow, Spritzy, Swirlix, Dedenne, Cutie Fly, Morlil, and for the rare encounters, Togetic, and of course, the white and orange Flabby Bees. And all of these are available as shinies, except for the Flabby Bees. And in addition to all of the wild encounters, we are also going to have seven kilometer eggs during this event. And if you were a fan of shiny hunting, Cutie Fly, the hatch from the eggs are going to have a greater chance of being shiny than cutie fly that you find in the wild. So there will be increased shiny rates for cutie flies that you hatch. But in addition to cutie fly being in the seven kilometer eggs, you'll also be able to find Togepi, Spritzy, and Swirlix, all of which can also be shiny. And if that wasn't enough Pokemon for you, there's also going to be a bunch of field research task encounters, since there will of course be event themed field research available throughout the event. So once you complete the research task, you'll have the chance of encountering Alolan Bullpix, Spritzy, Swirlix, Cutie Fly, and for the rare encounters, Mawile and Carbink. And all of these guys can be shiny except for Carbink. And not only are you gonna be getting wild encounters, or not wild encounters, but field research encounters, but completing certain field research tasks will also give you Mega Gardevoir energy and Mega Altaria energy. And it looks like we're also getting a couple of collection challenges. It says Dazzling Dream Collection Challenges are coming. Complete the Dazzling Dream Collection Challenges and receive XP, Stardust, and an encounter with Carbink. And of course, no big event in Pokemon Go is ever complete without a new avatar item. So there is going to be a cutie fly mask available in the in-game shop as well, which this is literally just like the derpy thing but like you know if you're into it and then if you did want to get a little bit more bang for your buck there is going to be some paid timed research for two dollars which if you complete the research tasks are going to earn you two premium battle passes xp stardust two star pieces and encounters with more event themed Pokemon. However, keep in mind that since this is timed research, you do have to claim and finish all of the research tasks and claim all of your rewards before Tuesday, January 16th at 8 p.m. local time. But there you have it. That is everything that you need to know about the Dazzling Dream event. Hopefully you guys found this video helpful. And if you did, I kindly suggest that you consider subscribing so that I can continue to make content for you guys. And if you are already subscribed and you would like another way to support the channel, feel free to check out the merch store. There is a link down below in the description that takes you to not only my merch store, but also all of my other socials so you can keep up with what I'm doing on a daily basis. But thank you guys so much for watching and thank you to those of you who have joined the channel as members. I appreciate you all so much. I love you guys and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.